Well, hey, family. This is Darlene. Happy Tuesday. Hope everybody is doing well today. Uh, stopping by like really quick. Um, I've been working on men necklaces and um, I haven't been recording myself making these because I'm still in the trial stages of like, you know, what I really want them to look like and um, just kind of playing with them. And I do like the way they're coming out. And I know a lot of jewelry is tagged as unisex. Um, and I guess these would be unisex, but I do want them to be more masculine. I want them to look stronger. I want them to look more manly, like, you, you know, just masculine. I want them, and I don't have the proper uh, supplies for what I want. So this weekend, if God says the same, I'm going to go out and um, find a bunch of supplies that look like they might work for what it is that I want to do. I do like the way the crosses came out. These are really nice. And I think I will be doing more crosses and probably using the bigger beads. These are the nine millimeter beads. And I'm probably use um, maybe some 20 millimeter. Use the 20 millimeter and then just make it like a really huge, nice uh, cross and then use the silver wire that I have to finish it and then create the cross, this part. So I really love the cross the way it came out. Um, and then I use some of that leather that I have around here and put some of these uh, coconut chips on here and just kind of finish it off with the bigger beads and just a uh, different color, different color beads. So I do like the way it came out. Um, I think it looks very masculine. You know, just really, really a nice piece. And it slides, uh, you know, just slides over the head. Very secure. Um, really nice. I, I really, really nice. like this one. And then this is the smaller cross. This is the brown. And then I added some little extra uh, bead in here just to give it a different kind of look. Um, smaller cross, the big bead, and then I went with nine millimeter and then some of the uh, hex nuts and then mixed the different color beads in here. And I really like the way this one came out. I just really like them. I really love the way that they look. Um, just really, really, really nice. Um, and I'm hoping they will be a hit whenever I begin to, you know, put them up for, for sale. So I really like the way they look. I think they're coming out really nice. I think I'm going to just do a nice little series on uh, cross cross uh, necklaces, men necklaces. Um, and then I'm working on some other things that will go well with the YouTube channel. Some other little stuff that, a little projects I'm working on. And these will, these meaning the men necklaces will be a part of that new project that I'm working on. So I really like, I like these. What you guys think? Let me know what you think. I really love the way they came out. And I, I can see how a bigger cross would really, you know, make this look really, really good. Just a really nice, huge uh, cross, a big, big one with the black beads and I do have some more black beads that I painted. Um, I need to put a, a light little gloss on them, a little shine on them. And then I'm going to use those and probably come back. I might even make those on, on camera, but I'm just uh, kind of feeling my way through for the men. Cause a couple of times I had to take it loose cause I didn't like the way it looked either one of these. So I had to take it apart, put it back together, take it loose again and say, uh, I don't like that. Cause I was using some other beads. And I said, no, nah, I really don't like that because it. I tend to kind of uh, slide into making them more feminine. And I don't want them to look womanish or feminine. I want them, if anything, they can look unisex, but I do want them to be more masculine. So that's why I'm going to go try to find some, uh, some supplies over the weekend, if God says the same, so I can make more masculine uh, pieces. But that's all. Just stopping by, saying hey, and... Um, you know, just kind of sharing, sharing the, the men's necklaces. 
And thank you to all the new subscribers for uh, subscribing, joining us here on the YouTube uh, on the YouTube channel. I do hope whatever made you hit subscribe or even view whatever video that you viewed, you continue to be encouraged and inspired to watch more and maybe even start to create. Um, if you're not already creating, um, to start creating. And if you are creating, hopefully you'll see something here that will inspire you to um, keep creating and make it more. And even if nothing, get some really good jury making ideas. And guess what, family? We'll talk.